Lord God, I pray for your protection to be upon everyone that is going to watch this video. Pray for your blood to cover everyone that is going to see this. Lord God, I pray for your Holy Spirit to speak through me and transform every life that needs to be transformed through you, O oh God. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. So last night, God gave me this dream, and I was in a large auditorium, um, almost like a stadium, and it was filled with so, so, so many people. And we were all seated, um, you know, seated in this auditorium. There were people above me, people below me, um, people towards my left, my right, everywhere. And I don't know how my oldest son was able to find me in this crowded room, but he did. So I had him sit down next to me and we were all like facing the center of the the room and at the very front of the like the front and center of this room I saw God the Father seated on his throne and there was a bright light shining all around him and his face was was made out of this light so I could not see his face but I saw like you know from his knee downward and he was sitting on his throne and he began to speak and when he began to speak his voice was so loud it filled the entire room and everything was shaking every word that he would say would just shake the room and shake everybody that was in the room so as he was speaking he called the name of my youngest son. He called his full name out. And there were angels on both sides of God in this vision. They were, you know, lined on the on the sides of him. So when he called my, my son, my son came and stood before God. And I was so excited. I was so happy to be in the presence of God in this vision and when he called my son's name i'm not sure if it was a a video that played or if it were, there was an angel but everything that my son did in his life was played out before god and this happened in a matter of seconds and after this all all the things he did was played out God told my son that he lived a good life and he told my son to go into his kingdom. And I saw this bright white light on the right side of God. But on the left side, there was like a orange reddish glow coming from that side. So he told my son to enter into heaven, which was on the right. And when he said that, my son turned around and faced the crowd. And when he did, there was this bright light that came over my baby and covered him from the top of his head to his feet. And he had like these streaks of, of bright light coming like out from the top of his head. And my son was being transformed by this light. And I saw an oil that was poured over my child. And the oil came from his head and came all the way down his his feet. And an angel came and clothed my son in this white garment. And my son had been transformed by the glory of God. It was so beautiful. So after he received his garment, he went into heaven he walked towards the right and I asked God what is this Lord what is this goldish reddish light that I see here on the left God told me that that was hell heaven and hell is real 
God is real. Please, if you do not know Jesus, accept him in your life today. Ask him to be your Lord and Savior. He is the only way to heaven. He is the only way to everlasting life. It doesn't matter what you've done in your past. It doesn't matter who you are. Right now, the door of heaven is still open for you. Very, very soon, the book of life will close. And Jesus will come to rapture his bride. You do not want to be left behind. This world is going to be a very, very horrible place once the rapture takes place. You do not want to be left here. Please give your life to him today. There is so much happening in this world that has been prophesied in the book of Revelation. Right now, babies are getting microchipped. In Europe, newborn babies are being microchipped with the RFID chip. Jesus is on the way. Please, guys, give your life to him. Accept him, repent from your sins, and live a life of righteousness because the kingdom of heaven is at hand. Jesus will be here soon. So accept him. Accept him today.